Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I am undecorating my Christmas tree. Usually I wait until after the new year to decorate, to undecorate um, all of the Christmas decorations, but this year I wanted to get it out the way and do it early and I am starting by taking off the star from the top of the tree and moving along I'm just going to be taking, starting basically from the top working my way down. Um, um, starting with these silver branch sheath swirly things that I got from Hobby Lobby, taking those out. My thoughts of going in doing this, um, I just actually went in with no thought, actually, <laughs> if I'm being totally honest. But um, I just watched a video um, of someone doing this yesterday so I figured I would do it myself because I knew I was about to take down my tree so I'm just taking all of the things that are the same off of the tree first um and then moving along to the other sections like all of this gar garland um I'm taking that down um as you can see my tree was all white this year I went for a winter wonderland type theme for my Christmas tree this year and um yeah I'm just taking it and putting it all into these clear bins that I purchased from Walmart which are very easy and convenient and I can just pack it all up and the boys can put it in my attic um <clears throat> so yeah just taking my time um carefully taking all of the pieces off of the tree and as you can see some of it is falling and I have my little helper over there on a sofa well there he is he's helping me pick up the little um the little ornaments that fell that is my six-year-old son Caleb um and he is a truly big help to mommy in this video here um so yeah, he'll be very excited once this video is uploaded and he see himself on the TV. So yeah, um, I have my oldest son Cameron recording as I am doing this. So yeah, we're taking the stuff off the tree. Um, next year, this Christmas tree is actually going to go into my kitchen because next year I want a bigger, maybe like a seven, seven and a half feet, um, flocked white flocked tree so make sure I'm going to put this one into my kitchen in a corner and yeah I'm going to have two Christmas trees next year <laughs> I mean it was good while it lasted I did purchase this Christmas tree last year from Home Depot but um this year I wanted something bigger but I just um stuck with this one and decorated this one but next year your girl is getting her big tree my husband already knows. So yeah, back to undecorating. I'm just going around the tree, making sure everything is off. Um, yeah, I didn't have this plan at all. I just said that I was going to come home and undecorate the Christmas tree. Um, when I got off from work, I had to stop to the grocery store and I was in the process of actually, well, not in the process, but I had already started making my vegetable soup, which I wanted to record that in a video as well for you guys, but I ended up not doing it. Um, I just took my shower um, and stuff like that, and I just was like, I'm going to just record me undecorating the Christmas tree and not do two videos in one since I was doing both of those things at the same time. So, yeah. <clears throat> So here I am just making sure all of the ornaments are in the ornaments bin and all of the, um, like my picks and all of the fancy ornaments are in the other, um, bin. I wanted to like take some of those, like my two, um, I think it was like a snowflake, white ones I wanted to wrap those up but I could not find the paper that it came in um but it still ended up fine I still ended up um just covering it all in my tree skirt that's at the bottom of the tree and I just wrapped it in there to make sure nothing broke within the next 12 months <laughs> so yeah <clears throat> so yeah it's kind of sad I was kind of like 
not feeling it when I was taking it down because I'm like, man, Christmas is over already. Like, can you believe it, you guys? Like, we're knocking on 2020 and it is, it's crazy to me. It's, it's flabbergasting. Like, I cannot believe that it's a new year already. Um, and I'm taking down the Christmas tree. <laughs> this is crazy. I felt like I, I just put it up and we just decorated it and I didn't record that but I did want it to record me taking it down look at Caleb he's such a big help um so yeah but that's what we're doing taking down a Christmas tree and you guys can continue to watch um no particular order that we were going in um well that I was going in um I wanted to do like same item by same item but since I had my little buddy helping me out, um, cause no lie, your girl back did start hurting. Mm -hmm, don't judge me, but still, um, because <laughs> as y'all can see, I was, look, listen, listen, like I have no shame in my game. There's a lot of things that I do around the house and, um, me with my weight and stuff like that. I try to do as minimal as possible, but I do have a lot to do around the house. I am a wife, a mother. Um, so I was cooking um, while I was doing this video. I had my oldest son recording, like I said. And then, girl, these lights was like really driving me. And this really where my lower back started hurting. But your girl pushed through and I got it done. So um, I didn't get all the way to the end. Um... As you can see, as the, as the video go on, you're just going to see me um, ended up taking the tree apart. And that's where the video is actually going to stop. Um, I didn't record me placing everything in the... Placing all the other stuff like the tree skirts and taking down the other uh, Christmas wreaths that I had on the front door, the pantry door and behind the front door and all of the little Christmas um, like decor that I had on our faux mantle. I didn't um, record me taking any of that off. Um, I just basically wanted to do the tree and not like go completely around my house. Um, so yeah, that's all I wanted this this video to be was just me taking down a Christmas tree. Um, my son is all over the place. I think he was trying to get the angles going on. <laughs> I mean, they're pretty excited about um, me doing this whole YouTube thing. So they're um, they're just happy to be a part of it all. So yeah, he can see me um, finally taking apart the tree. Um, this tree did have, um, multicolored lights that actually came on. This was a pre-lit tree that I got from Home Depot, but this year I didn't use the colorful lights, the multicolored lights. I just used all white. Um, so yeah, I'm going to insert a picture at the end of the video, um, so you guys can see exactly how the tree was decorated so yeah I'm just folding up my tree skirt and I'm just gonna just throw that down <laughs> throw that down in there um so yeah I just wanted to take it a loose um we're coming almost to the end of the video And at this point, I had to sit down because your girl was tired, okay? Like, my back was hurting. <laughs> so, yeah, I am just taking down a Christmas tree. And I wanted my son to record how much of a mess that having a Christmas tree, even, even if it's like the, um, what you call that? The flock trees, those regular trees. Um, regular false trees can leave can really leave a mess everywhere as you can see my son wants to be funny and peep his head in the video but this is pretty much the end of your video you guys I hope you guys enjoyed it like I did